Okay, students. Today we solve about the free particle radial wave functions. Free particle radial wave function. We know that the free particle means what is the free particle? Free particle means. The potential is zero in all space is called the free particles. So we derive the Schrodinger equation to obtain the radial part of the wave functions for a free particle. So we have the Schrodinger wave equations for free particles Schrodinger wave equation for free particles minus h squared square by 2 mu daily square psi of r equal to e psi of r this is equation 1 this mu is the reduced mass for the rigid rotator we are going to uh, in topic of rigid rotator, so we replace the mass of the particle by the reduced mass. Let us suppose the equation 1 has the plane wave solution. Let us suppose equation 1 has the plane wave solution. Equation 1 has the plane wave solution. So, this psi are written in terms of this Cartesian coordinate system. In Cartesian in Cartesian coordinate system, psi r equal to x of x, y of y, z of z and the separated solution and the separated in the separated solution are psi equal to 2 pi minus 3 by 2 into equal power i k dot r that means 2 pi minus 3 by 2 into eco power minus kf of x plus kyy plus kzz. This solution is obtained. What is why this term is appear? We know psi equal to the solution a into eco power i kx. Then normalize these wave functions psi star equal to a into equal power minus i k x and normalizing this equation we get the psi of x equal to 1 by root 2 pi into equal power i k x here is the plane wave solution that means there is a cartesian coordinate system in term of x y z in term of x y z this is the psi r r means the radial position position of x y and z so the total overall functions psi equal to equal power minus i k r into 2 pi minus 3 by 2 now now the eigen function for three component of the momentum p the eigen functions the eigen function of the three component that means x y z of the momentum p p equal to i x cut del we know that the operator p equal to minus i x cut del by del x in the three in the space the del by del x, del by del y, del by del z because all over the sum we get this delta. Okay, then 
minus i x squared what is delta now i am defining i del y del x plus del y del y plus e z del y del z where where e x e y and e z are unit vector along unit vector along x y and z now this p and above psi above psi this is in here this is psi this means u k of r multiplying that is p u k of r equal to i x cut minus e to the power x del by del x plus e y del by del y plus e z del y del z times this momentum p this momentum p this is the momentum and the uk of r equal to 2 pi by 2 pi minus 3 by 2 equal power i k dot r okay okay students okay students that means this constant terms 2 pi this constant term 2 pi minus i s cut and this term and this terms written same e to the power x del y del x plus e to the power y del y del y e to the power z del y del z into equal power i k of r positive i k of r this is we have the momentum p equal to x cut k show the substituting the value of k equal to p by x cut then p u k of r equal to minus i s cut 2 pi to power minus 3 by 2 sorry here is Eco power x del y del x eco power y del y del y plus eco power z del y del z times times eco power i this means the p i dot uh, k dot r p x of x in term of the momentum p z of z whole divided by x cuts after solving this we get p u k of r equal to p this is the operators p u k of r okay students we are showing the plane wave solution by considering this figure this is the x is y this is z this is the x y and z let us suppose this is the points at a position r and we draw the perpendicular this is k here here k dot r equal to constant infinite plane constant infinite plane a plane waves this plane wave is perpendicular to k is always constant that is k dot r equal to constant for infinite plane that is a plane waves perpendicular to k is defined by k dot r equal to constant okay the projection of the energy points the projection of energy points of this infinite plane projection of energy point for this infinite plane had the same value that is that is the energy points of this infinite plane It's same values. 
that is r that means r parallel equal to k dot r divided by mod of k in the direction of k in the direction of k look at this figure okay it means it means uk has the same value has the same value for phase difference for phase difference 2 pi on this plane on the plane that is k dot r equal to 2 pi plus constant only the phase difference now we are going to calculate the, the, the distance between the successive planes the distance between the successive plane that means the r dash and r this r should have what a distance the distance between this r and r dash that means the successive planes once comes after one another planes the distance between such successive plane the distance between successive plane is how much k dot r dash minus k dot r whole divided by k equal to 2 pi by k equal to lambda this is the this satisfy this satisfy this value satisfy the solution is the plane wave extend and infinite that means this justify this justify this justifies the name plane waves the name plane waves which are infinite extent and occupy all space which are infinite extent and occupy all space okay this is the position dependent now we are calculate the time dependent time dependent psi k r dot t equal to u k dot u k of r in t equal power minus i e t by s cut from this we can calculate this time dependence u k had the same value when for momentum p u k of r has the same value for momentum p so p dot r minus energy t equal to constant and p dot r equal to constant plus et it representing the plane wave propagating in direction of increasing r parallel thank you for watching my video for more videos subscribe my channel and i will show next particle in a spherical waves thank you students please subscribe my channel i hope you subscribe please please please